Hey, what's up and welcome back to my page. It's your girl, you should be. So, um, the things that I've been kind of up to, because as y'all know, I kind of I kinda come and go when it comes to this page, but we are getting it together, y'all. So, since I've been technically gone, um, I created, from my book, Homebody, I created a fitness program that I have available on my website, youshipu.com. And when you're not looking for that, you can go to my food blog, where all the different food that I'll be showing you, that I'm going to start showing you guys now, will be up there, quicker recipes that you can kind of get, just jot down the directions up there. Hey guys, and happy today. So, welcome to the day, y'all, and what I'm gonna do today is I'm going to cook. Now, this is um, a dish I've made before. I'm not gonna make it a lower calorie. It's just already a lower calorie dish. So, things that you'll need for this dish. You will need regular sauce because we are making um, stuffed peppers. And these are our peppers that we're gonna use on today. Three of them. So it'll be six servings because, well, I guess three servings. Depends on how you break it down. Um, Cause I'll be eating two halves today. We have cheese. I have the non-dairy cheese and then I have regular cheese. As well as mozzarella, we mix in it. Um, I'll be putting mushroom or spinach in there. So basically it is stuffed Spanish rice um, and shrimp peppers. So that's basically what the dish is. And this is gonna be on the side dish. This is just zucchini and squash, okay? So basically all the different ingredients that you'll need on today is an onion, two uh, jalapenos, so two instant rice. You can do regular rice, but I like instant, it works for me. Um, you're gonna need your bell peppers, bell peppers, your sauce to go into your rice for the Spanish rice. Is it a Spanish or Mexican rice? I'm not sure which one exactly, but I found the recipe online a while ago and I kind of made it my own, so it's inspired. And then you have spinach. Now, I didn't put spinach in my dish before, but we're gonna put spinach in it today to make it a little bit healthier. Okay, and then we need our seasonings. The seasoning I'm using today is salt, pepper. So we got salt, pepper. We got turmeric, onion powder, cilantro for the end. We have cayenne, which is just my go-to. Chipotle chili pepper, cumin, what's the rest of it, or the rest left of it anyway, garlic powder, and I have more cumin in case I need it. Now I'm going to prep everything and then we'll get started. Okay, so this one is for my rice, this one is for that. All right, so now the rice is on. I've already finished chopping all the jalapenos and now we are moving on to the shrimp. Now what I am deciding to do, or just decided to do is to prep my shrimp in advance. So I'm going to peel them. I don't like ends on my shrimp, I don't care. Chopping the shrimp piece ends off. And then I'm going to cut them because I want shrimp in every bite of my rice because that is what's going to be stuffed inside of my pepper. And so with that being said, here we go. Now I'll let my shrimp defrost earlier. I'm just gonna peel the ends, chop them in the bowl. And I have my scissors over here and I'm going to cut them. All right, so now what I'm doing with my shrimp is cutting them into pieces. I probably should make it cut into four. Yeah, we'll do four. All right, so it's four pieces now. I'm gonna put a few more shrimp in here because I don't have enough to take any of these to put on the side. All right, so these are all of the ingredients. Now we're gonna throw the peppers in the oven and get those started. When they're halfway done cooking, flip them over. Now let's move on to our zucchini and squash. All right, so once you have them all in, just add your salt, add your pepper, and don't forget your butter. Here is our zucchini and our squash. The only thing I use in this is salt, pepper, and butter. Now you can cook your zucchini a lot lighter than this. Cook it less, but so here it is. All right, so now we're going to do our rice. You're gonna throw in your olive oil. You're gonna to toss in your jalapenos as well as your onions and give that a stir. Once your onions and jalapenos are cooked a little bit, you wanna go ahead and add in your seasoning. Then you're gonna add in your corn, 
and add a little bit more of your olive oil. Chop up your spinach or keep them whole and then set that aside. Now let's move on to our shrimp. You're gonna go ahead and throw your seasoning on top and give that a stir. And then you're gonna pull out your larger shrimp to sit aside. They'll be added on top of the pepper later. With the rest of the mix, you're gonna add in your corn and jalapeno onion mixture back into your shrimp. You're gonna add in one bag of rice. And now you're gonna add in your red sauce and give that a good mix and set it aside. Okay, so I basically have, I just about have a shrimp in every bite, like I said I want it. I'm just doing a quick, I'm doing a quick test. Mmm. Mmm. Oh yeah. This is good. All right, so now you're gonna stuff your peppers. We're gonna start with cheese on the bottom. This is cheddar cheese. Then you're gonna add your mozzarella on top of that. Then you're gonna take your Spanish rice and fill each pepper. Now you're gonna take and put it back on the tray, add some more cheese on top, add a few of those shrimps that you set aside, and add another layer of cheese, and then put it into the oven. Here's the final product. Now we're going to the oven for about 10 minutes for the cheese to melt. All right, and here's the finished product. Mmm, cheese. My lower calorie play on Spanish rice, so that's mixed rice, with zucchini on the side as well as avocado. Thanks for tuning in. Until next time.